make sense when I'm with you. Hey everyone, okay, so today what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing my September favorites for 2012, and I'm so excited to be doing these favorites because I have, I just love October, because October is more to me the month of transition, transition, um, because fall officially started in September, but I feel like October is when actually you see things change. You see crisper weather, you see more leaves fall on the ground, you can get out your boots, you can get out your Uggs, you can get out your sweaters, you can get out your scarves, um, you can get out your hot chocolate, <clears throat> and that looks so weird. So I just, I just love the fall time. Um, but I have a few pieces that I have kind of been getting ready for the fall time, and I just really love fall. Obviously, I've already said it. Um, so, I hope you guys enjoy this video, but before I get started, you may notice I have a different background. My grandma was kind enough to take me fabric shopping and also make curtains for me. Um, I decided I really wanted to go with a creamy color. So this is like a really thick, dur durable canvas that is just awesome. And I didn't just want plain, so of course... I had to go with a printed bottom and I picked this fabric and she just sewed it nicely on and I'm just so thankful. So you'll be seeing a neutral background for the rest of my videos um, because I just really like this filming location. Um, yeah, so this will be my new background and I'm so sorry today that the day I show you my background, the day I'm wearing a neutral outfit. Totally poor planning on my part. but. So I'm going to be talking about my beauty favorites and I hope you guys all enjoy and without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so my first product is this moisturizer and this is an oil-free, oil-absorbing moisturizer, all day shine control. And it just looks like this, it's by Clean and Clear. It has all these amazing factors, so it's oil-free, all day shine control, it's super absorbing which is so true. And it has SPF 15, so I am wearing SPF right on my face right now, which is always good. And I just really like it. I really feel like it's really thin, and it just, it, it, it has this specialness to it that's just, like, awesome. It's, it's so good. I really like this moisturizer. It does its job very, very well. So I have another skincare product, and this is the Pore Professional Pro Balm Minimize the Appearance of Pores by Benetint. Benefit. Sorry. This is Benefit. Um, it just looks like this. I love the packaging. I love the color of this. It is like... I just love the color of this. It makes me smile every time I look at it. It's just such a beautiful color. Um, I really like this because I can put it under my eyes and like my pores are pretty much minimized. They look really really natural or really really nice and I don't really notice a huge difference and I feel like they do look very different and I don't know like I don't have huge wrinkles but just like they minimize them to satisfy me and that's all that matters. And I have been loving this blush. It is my obsession. I am forever in love. <clears throat> I used to never, I didn't touch this at all during the summer because I was producing oil and I put, to, put, to put a creamy blush on top just never worked out for me. So now that it's fall and I have an oil control, oil free skincare line, I can whip this back out. And this is the NYX Rouge Cream Blush and Glow. So, just looks like that. It's just a beautiful pink. I love this pink so, so, so much. I really like it for multiple reasons. It is a really creamy blush, and it comes true to color. You know, like some of those blushes where you look at it in the packaging, it's a really dark berry color, and it turns out to be like the lightest pink you own. Like, it's not one of those colors. It's a true to color blush. And they are like $5 and you get what you pay for. $5 for this, you might even get more than what you pay for. I feel like Tarte could sell these and pay, you can spend $20 on them. And then you can get them from NYX. Like, I feel like they are so good. They're so well made. And I just don't know. I, I, was, I just wanted to smell it. I never smelled it before. Is that weird? Um, I really like this blush and it just is a really natural blush too. I've been really into this recently, and this is the Maybelline New York Color Tattoo in Bad to the Bronze. 
So it just looks like this. And the color is a nice bronzy kind of shimmery champagne color. And I just think it looks so good on your face and <laughs> on your eyes. And I noticed that my crease color does not move. This is just amazing. And I really like the color. It gives a nice base to my crease color. So I really like this. Two lip products. The first one that um, I wear if I really want my lips to stand out and I want them to last all day, I will reach for my Benetint. So, just looks like this. And this is a nice, like, death kind of color. That's what I think of when I think of this. I think of death blood. And it, I'm not trying to be, like, all like, oh my god. Like, no, I'm just saying what the color is if you can't really see. <clears throat> so, there it is. And it's just a nice, rosy kind of tint. Um, you can definitely build this up to get a really strong color. I normally do two layers of this. And it gives me the right amount of redness that I love. And then, of course, I have to mention this. My favorite red lipstick or red chapstick thing has been my Maybelline Baby Lips. And it just looks like that. Oh, so beautiful. I love it. Beautiful as always. And this is in Cherry Me. And I cannot believe how much I've used. Like, it just doesn't seem real to me. So, it's just right this, like this, and it looks darker than it actually is. It is actually a very sheer, sheer red, and it just looks so natural, and I just, I love this blush. I love this lipstick so much. So, I have two nail products, and they are right here, and the first one that I have been loving is not a nail product. Well, it's a nail product. <clears throat> and it is the Sally Hansen Diamond Strength Diamond Shine Base and Top Coat. So it just looks like this. This looks like this. And this is the best top coat and base coat. My nail polish, I painted them Sunday. And I didn't chip them till today, which is Thursday. And it really shocked me that Sunday they didn't chip. Monday, Tuesday, and then Wednesday. That's four days and five days, depending on if you look at this morning and stuff like that. But still, five days? That's like a full week of school. Like, it's crazy to me that they lasted that long because most of the time my nails only last like two days if I... with any other top coat. So this is a really good top coat and I recommend it to all of you. And a total awesome color that I love. It is definitely in for fall. You guys just saw it on my fall nail polish guide. <laughs> um, yeah, but this is the Wet n Wild Wild Shine and Nail Look Hair in Red Red. It's just a nice beautiful red. I actually just had this on my nails. I'm actually thinking of repainting my nails just because of how much I love it. And it's just a beautiful color and all around inexpensive, cheap, and beautiful. Inexpensive and cheap are synonyms, so don't use them in the same sentence. It'd make you sound completely stupid when you think you're sounding smart. Hmm. I just did it. But anyway, I really like this color, and it is beautiful on all nails, and I think anyone can pull it off. And anyone can pay for it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'm so sorry for the lack of videos. I have had been crammed with a bunch of homework, and now I have a four-day weekend because it's Columbus. And, well, I have one more day of school, but, um, I don't have to do any of it until Tuesday night. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll definitely see you guys in my next video, and thank you so much for watching. Bye!